What's up, beautiful people? Welcome back to my channel. You are tuned in once again with Cindy. If you are new to my channel, I want to let you know that I post videos on fitness and my career, which is running track professionally. I also like to produce health videos and the types of recipes I like to eat, and as well as my faith. I like to share my faith, and I want to let everybody know that this is something that's really huge in my life. So, if these are videos that might interest you in some way, don't forget to subscribe to my channel because I will be producing more videos just like this this weekly. Today, as I was praying about it, I felt that God said he wanted me to share to you guys something that I think can truly impact you, which is identifying your gifts and using those gifts to give him glory. God has given us all specific gifts, and these gifts are unique to, and tailored to all of us. He wants us to use these gifts to live a purposeful life, to live a life that brings him glory ultimately, but also brings us peace and joy and just contentment because he wants us to live a life of purpose. Anybody watching right now has gifts that will help bring God glory. So in today's video, I just want to address this and help you bring out these qualities that you have within and help you, um, I guess, mold it into something that brings your life more purpose and more joy and happiness. So if this is something you're interested in listening to, make sure you tune into the rest of this video. A scripture that really shows that God gives us specific gifts is a scripture that I like from 1 Peter and it says, each of you should use whatever gift you have received to serve others as faithful stewards of God's grace in its various forms. If anyone speaks, they should do as one who speaks the very words of God. If anyone serves, they should do so with the strength of God provides, so that in all things God may be praised through Jesus Christ. To him be the glory and the power forever and ever. This scripture truly shows that God has given us all unique gifts. We are all different, but we all have something very special that can make a huge impact on the world. And I believe that you right now have something so wonderful inside of you that if you bring it out and you realize what it is and you realize your vision towards this, then you will truly be in a place of just happiness and a place of purpose and a place of just walking in your calling. Personally, for me, I know that I have multiple gifts. So obviously a big one is my ability to run fast, <laughs> my ability to hurdle, and my ability to compete at a professional level in track. So God has given me this this gift, not just to run and receive accolades and all this good stuff, but he also wants me to do it, to bring him glory, to use my other gifts that I have to share his word, to share his love for us. He also wants me to show how, if you're operating in your uh, abilities, how much you can um, impact the world. Not only has God given me a gift with running, but I know that God has given me a gift with being able to teach, being able to educate, being able to speak life over people and encourage and to motivate um, and to cope. You know, he's given me so many qualities that I definitely believe that that's very specific to me. So I want you guys to think about today, whether it's right now while you're watching this video or later on in the evening or morning, whatever time it is for you, think about your qualities that you love, those desires in your heart that just make you so excited and you know that if you're working on something specific tailored to this gift, you can do it for hours without being distracted. Think about that gift. Think about whatever it is that you feel that God has really given you that's set apart from this world and whatever that gift is that's something that you can truly use to encourage people to uh, bring people to him and I believe that that's really in you so I would identify your gifts and your qualities uh, maybe just writing them down or maybe just thinking about them and thinking okay what are some ways I can use this so let's say if you're a doctor you're an engineer you're a CEO you're just a student you're a stay-at-home mom these things are very useful in a different way so you could use all these qualities in those careers or in anything you're doing and I believe once you realize what those are it's so much easier to have a life of purpose once you identify your gifts it's also important to have a vision and just know how you want to impact the world God told us in that scripture that our gifts are given to help others it's not about us when God gives us a blessing and a gift he's doing it with not just us in mind but others in mind because he wants to bring people to him so you need to identify how you want to make a change what do you want to see you know different in the world or how do you want to make things exciting you can see something as simple as maybe you're in the entertainment industry and you want to see people smile from your from your gift and you want to see people laugh from your gift maybe you're a comedian you can use these gifts or these things that you feel like God's called you to do to really bring glory 
glory to him and to really um, exhibit the fruits of the spirit. So I would recommend when you figure out your qualities and your gifts, I would recommend identifying a vision or an impact that you want to have in the world. And that will allow you to start to plan and mold each day towards this specific vision or mission that you have. For me, I know that I have other gifts I, I know I'm going to use once I am done running. So he has just used so many different things to show me that I have a lot of ways to bring him glory. But you can start using your gifts right now, today, to implement in your life. Maybe you want to start speaking more. You know that you have a gift of speaking, but you don't feel comfortable to have to ask God for to use your qualities in a God-glorifying way. I believe that you, should, you can start doing it right now, and you can start changing the lives of others because once you start being in purpose and you start fulfilling this calling on your life, you will start to realize the joy in your heart and the happiness that it brings is going to just make you feel so at peace. And it's going to make you feel like your life has a lot more meaning to it. And I'm really excited because I really want everybody to have this newfound peace that I'm starting to receive from the Lord. But yeah, so just start doing it whatever way possible today. Start implementing these newfound gifts that you know God's giving you into your life in some small shape or form. And each day you will build and it will start to manifest into something huge one day. And I'm looking forward to seeing that in everybody's life. So make sure you do comment down below on some gift you believe you have or some um, purpose that you feel like you have in your life. I would love to hear and have a conversation and dialogue with you guys but thanks again for tuning into this video and if you like this video and my faith videos give me a thumbs up and let me know in the comments um, anything else you want to see or um, anything you like about these faith videos as well as don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you will not miss out on other videos and also hit the notifications bell just so you'll be alerted for when I post. Thank you guys for tuning into this video once again and I will see you all in my next video. Bye!